name is Alex and welcome to my first Married at First Sight video. I kind of cringe even saying that, but <laughs> we're doing it. So Married at First Sight, the Australian version, has started up the past week and a bit, two weeks I think we're in. Um, and I have been watching it, unfortunately. I've been watching it because there has been this groundbreaking first lesbian couple on the show. Uh, first queer couple at all on the show. Um, and I wanted to check it out. I wanted to see <laughs> how the couple was like, you know, I just wanted to see, you know, I, I cannot stand the show. It is so cringy, but I had to check it out and I had to make a video on it. I really did. So, I mean, obviously like all my review videos, if you don't want to be spoiled on anything, then don't watch this video. I'm going to be talking about everything sort of I mean, yeah, touching on everything that's happened over the last couple weeks. Um, but, you know, if you're just wanting to, to hear the awfulness that's been happening without having to watch the show, it's a perfect video for you. So let's get into this. I mean, I like everything, like everything. I do go in with hope. I go in wanting it to be great, but it's married at first sight. I mean, all the couples are awful. They're just not good for each other. Or they're fake. <laughs> so, I mean, it shouldn't be any surprise that the lesbian couple is just, oof, it's a train wreck. It really is. To really get down to the point, um, Tash and Amanda. Their names are Tash and Amanda. My personal opinion, I really like Tash. I do. I, sh I relate to her, I guess. I don't know. I think she's cool. She's fun. She's flirty. I am down, I'm down for her. She's great. I'm here for her. Amanda, I cannot stand at all. I think she is awful. I cannot stand her. So essentially, you know, they get married, obviously. Just married at first sight. Um, they were, you know, there was an, an initial attraction. They're both gorgeous women, obviously. Um, and, you know, there was a lot of flirtiness. And it just seemed like they hit it off really well on the first night. Unfortunately, like day one of the honeymoon, Tash is kind of like... I'm actually not really feeling it. Like, obviously, I think, you know, she says Amanda's obviously attractive, but she's just not feeling that chemistry, that spark between them. Um, and she, you know, is a flirty person to begin with. So she was flirting a lot at the wedding. But, you know, now taking a step back, realizing the situation, sort of processing the situation, she's like, it's just not clicking with me. And Amanda just... <sighs> She's obviously feeling like something was off. So she would like hounded Tash to be like, just be blunt about your feelings. Like don't hide anything. Don't hold anything back. Just be blunt. And so Tash told her, she's like, I'm just not feeling it. You know, there's not a click. It's just, there's like, it's no one's fault. And you know, it's, it's just what it is. This is where my dislike for Amanda comes into play. She like, oh, she really kind of goes off and utter. And I'm like, Jesus, like this isn't something that anyone's done or anyone has a, any control over. You're either attracted to people or you're not. That's just like as simple as it is. But you know, first of all, she like, it's like she, it doesn't even process in her brain. She doesn't even, she is in complete denial. She keeps on telling Tash to be like, if she wants to call it quits, then just tell her, you know, if she's not attracted to her, tell her. And Tash is like, I have. I have already. <laughs> and then Amanda goes from that to just like, again, complete denial and is like blaming Tash for them not connecting and has gone down this path of Tash really needs to earn her like respect and love and she has a lot to repay her for. Um, so Tash needs to make everything up. And I'm like, what are you talking about? What? Tash doesn't want to be there. Like, what? At the dinner party last night, like, Amanda's like, you know, if this doesn't mean, like, pointing to her ring finger, that's the ring finger, actually. <laughs> if this doesn't mean anything, then, like, what does and blah, blah, blah. It's like, you know, how can she flirt with all these other girls and blah, blah, blah. And it's like, she literally told you she doesn't feel any connection towards you. She doesn't want to continue this relationship she just hasn't been given the opportunity to walk out yet. Like, like how much more simply do you want that? And she keeps on trying like all these pressure techniques. Like, oh, you know, I should be allowed like in the, in the same room as us. You know, we don't have to do anything. But when nothing happens, she gets all pissy. It's like, 
you know, you that it, this is a relationship, not a friendship. It's like, Jesus, like you're putting so much pressure on someone to be intimate with you. That's so gross. Like, I just cannot stand Amanda at all. So yeah, I am disappointed. I really did want to root for the lesbian couple on Married at First Sight, but I mean, as expected, it, I mean, first of all, it's a reality show. <laughs> Like, they're not going to be this lovey-dovey couple. It's just, it's it's not going to happen. They, their purpose is to find people that's going to cause the most drama. They don't actually care about if they find love or whatever. It's all about drama and ratings for them. So, like, of course it's never going to end well. And then, of you know, the second part is, it's on Australian TV. So it's, lesbian couples never going to end well. <laughs> but I did want to give you my thoughts, my feels... I'm probably still going to watch it as long as they're still on it. And if I have anything more to add, I'll probably make another video. But, I mean, it's pretty straightforward. They're an awful couple. Amanda is gross. I don't like her at all. You know, she's hot, she's attractive, sure. But, oof, I don't like her. Oof. I can totally understand why Tash is not into it. Oof. But, yeah, I mean, if you guys have been watching it, if you guys are Australian and have been watching it, I'd like to know your thoughts. But, honestly, <laughs> like, yeah. It is what it is. But I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, hit that like button and subscribe if you're new. I'll see you guys in my next one. Okay, bye.